gone to extreme lengths to secure the perfect vantage point. Before most of us were out of bed this morning, John Saunders was already in position. Tell me how long you've been waiting here. Since quarter past six. A commitment he made for his kids. The kids want to see the fireworks, so we'll wait till 8.30, see the kids once, and then we'll head off. At least he's not waiting alone. Happy with your view? I think so. I think it'll be good. Let's hope so. By midnight, Peter Bradbury will have been sitting here for 12 hours. The reason why? My wife. <laughs> Just a good husband. I am. I'm just a good husband. Music and snacks helping to pass the time. Do you think it'll be worth it? I think so, because we're a pretty good spot for, for fireworks, I guess. The fireworks barge is packed and in position. South Bank is the most popular spot to view tonight's colourful displays. Road closures started early. Security is tight. Police are on patrol as thousands fill the parklands. And to avoid the crowds, plenty of people will ring in the new year at private functions like here at the W Brisbane. Enjoying food, drinks and a view until midnight. The hotel's actually sold out, so it's amazing. It'll be a really great, fun, vibrant atmosphere. Getting home will be easier with free public transport from 8pm until 5.30am. But along with that free public transport, we'll also see extra services across the southeast corner to ensure that people are able to get home safely and in a timely manner. New Year's Eve is no party for paramedics. So we do get very busy around the 12 o'clock on which in relation to um, drug and alcohol fuel incidents. Their ranks have been boosted by 270 extra staff tonight, but everyone can play a part in staying safe. Look after your family uh, and friends um, and just help them through the night. To ensure it's a memorable night for the right reasons. Well, numbers are really starting to build here in South Bank. The concert, and the grass here is quickly being snapped up by family. They still have quite a long wait until those first fireworks at 8.30, with, of course, a second show at midnight. It is absolutely not too late to get down here. Parking is very limited, but those free buses and trains start at 8 p.m., Sam. Like a lot of fun to Liam Bland on the Gold Coast. Liam, plenty of people have already arrived for celebrations there.